What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Y walkthrough. Okay, so guess what, guys? In the last episode, your boy did it. He got himself his first badge. Yeah, buddy. That's right. We got our first badge. And, well, it is time for us to go take the long way to, well, the second badge, because I don't know why they would, uh, you know, they, they would do that. Make the second badge a little longer than expected. But, anywho... We are now able to go into Route 4 and capture a butt-ton of Pokemon, guys. There's literally a butt-ton of Pokemon here in this place. Holy buckets. Okay, so as you guys can see, you'll be able to find a lot of elusive Pokemon, including Combi itself. And uh, one of the big things that I want to do here into this walkthrough is that, you know, I want to capture as many Pokemon as possible. Uh, and then eventually have an all Kalos team right here in this game in comparison to the last one. Now, after... I, I kind of I want to say after we uh, we do the whole, uh, what was it, the Professor Sycamore event, I will have the last team into this game right here. And that would be the one with Greninja and all that stuff. Now, we won't be able to use them. Yeah, they're too overleveled and all that stuff. But they will be here because, well, yeah, we kind of want to see the old gang... I don't want to fill up the Pokedex just a tad bit. You know what I'm talking about. And, well, as you guys can see, we got ourselves Combi. And this is the male version. It will not evolve, if you guys haven't noticed that. And, uh, well, we're still looking for a Pokemon right here. Yeah, it's a specific Pokemon, not this guy, you know. It's kind of funny how, like, how you can find Ladybugs around here, too. So, I guess we're going to have to capture them and all that crud. So, here we go. And Ladyba is using Supersonic. So the good thing is that we're just going to like throw a, uh, a Pokeball at it and it will be easy and all that stuff. So let's go right ahead and throw that Pokeball. So let's see. Is there anything that I need to talk about in this episode? No, not really. There are a lot of good Pokemon right here. If I name them off, you guys will love them. So the Pokemon you'll find here, Badoo, Combi. Uh, Flabebe, Flabebe, Flabebe. <laughs> well, if you guys are trying to figure out how to get the different kinds of Flabebes, this is how it'll be, okay? Uh, in the yellow flowers, you'll be able to find yourself both the white flower and orange flower Flabebe, and yellow flower Flabebe. In the red flowers, you'll be able to find red flower Flabebes, uh, orange and white. It's just very, very rare. So if you always want to collect these Pokemon and you know, that's that's another great thing right here. Another Pokemon you can find is Ralts. Ralts is a very reliable Pokemon. And as you guys already know, bam! Here is Flabebe. But I kind of want... I, I kind of want the... Well, I kind of want the white one. If we can find it, so... Eh, we'll eventually capture one. See one on, on the way. What we got to do now is we got to grab ourselves those items... And bam, here we found ourselves a repel. Not bad. And, well, let's go straight to the other side right here. And, uh, well, hopefully they'll attack us or whatever. Okay. Here we have a yellow flower flabebe. Yellow flower flabebe. And, yeah, that's not going to be the one right there. So let's go right ahead and escape. <coughs> yeah, still, still coughing. And, well, we got to go through this little maze right here. And I am intentionally going into the... Yeah, I'm intentionally going into the flowers just to... Uh, <laughs> just to get to these Pokemon. And... Well... Let's get the heck out of here. And... Well, let's go ahead and find ourselves some, uh, some potions and whatever. You will be able to battle some people right here, so just keep an eye out for that. And, well, here we are. We found ourselves a super potion. And, well, let's see. Let's see if we can actually find a good Pokemon from here. I don't even know. <laughs> and what is it with these ladybugs? I don't want to capture you no more. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Okay, so let's go ahead and uh, do this. There it is. And, well, let's see. Let's go ahead and uh, let's see if we have some luck right now. Come on. Oh, come on. Okay, so we're 
Yeah, we, 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 we are not going to have any luck right here with trying to find any Pokemon of any use. So let's go right ahead and use... Uh, well, let's just defeat these Ladybugs. Pretty sure they're just, you know, swarming on us and all, on all in, in everything. So there you go, Ladybug. Say goodbye. Alrighty, okay. And bam! Aaliyah grows to level 11, which is already great. And Hurricane, without doing anything, yeah, growing levels too. Learning a sand attack and whatnot. Alrighty. Shoo, let's go. Let's not focus on that no more and grab this. Here we found ourselves a great ball. And I think after winning the first badge, you will be able to get yourself great balls. And, well, let's go right here. And there is literally nothing. So let's go straight towards the other section right here. And, yes, you will be able to find yourself an item and a Pokemon trainer. So, oh, wow, this guy is, like, not making it easy for us right here. Here we found ourselves an antidote. And, well... We are going to be battling this guy, so let's see what happens. Hmm. Alrighty. Gardner Wheaton. It's a pretty good name right there. And, well, Aaliyah. Let's get it. How's it going? You do it. You're looking lovely. Let's go with a Thundershock attack right here. And, bam. Thundershock does its thing. And here comes the bubbly attack. And that right there will hit us pretty hard. Okay. Alrighty. Let's go. Thundershock yet again. And just like that, Corpfish defeated. Okay. And Hurricane, again, doing nothing. Nothing whatsoever, but Star Fox grows to level 16. And Combi, yeah, gaining levels too. Mooching off the Pokemon. So, uh, yeah. Digivolution time. So, it has been a while, guys. I normally evolve these starter Pokemon by the first gym, but unfortunately, yeah, we, we, we don't really get that. We really don't get that right here. So, here's a great thing about this. When Star Fox, uh, Star Fox evolves, I believe it gains a psychic capability right here. So, here it is, guys. Star Fox has evolved into Braxian. Braxian, Braxian, I can't even pronounce that name right. Does it have the psychic capabil capabilities? Can't speak right. Let's see. Not this. Star Fox. Let's see. Nope. Still a fire type Pokemon. So, uh, yeah, we, we, we got a long way to go. But I think it can learn some uh, psychic type attack. I don't know. Comment down below, guys. And, yes, we did this intentionally because we want to capture some Pokemon. So, look at this. We have found ourselves a Skitty. Not bad. And, well, I'm going to capture it. Now, because I'm playing Pokemon, I'm playing Pokemon X, aside from this game right here, there will be, uh, who knows? The Pokemon that I want to get, I'm probably going to trade over just so I can actually have, like, some, some Pokemon right here. But they're going to be within the level confines and all that stuff, if that makes any sense. So, here we go. Pokeball, let's get it. And no, this Pokemon does not want to get captured. So here is a Tail Whip attack. Not awesome. Let's get it. And come on. Stay in the ball. Come on, don't be lame. Be cool. Be very cool. And just like that, we have captured a Skitty. Okay, alrighty. Look at that. Look at that. Okay, so this is Skitty. It's a normal type Pokemon. It shows its cute side by chasing its own tail until it gets dizzy. Okay, that is very cute. Very, very cute. Okay, so that right there finds us that Pokemon. So what I'm going to do right now, guys, is I'm going to go back to the Pokemon Center, put some Pokemon back into the PC, and then we're going to get back at it. So I'll be right back with you guys. Alrighty, guys, we're back, and well... Let's go right ahead and take a look at this. The Perle or the Perle Perla Fountain, except it's created a harm or creates harmony. So yes, this will be the you know the what you would call it the uh, wow. I keep on forgetting stuff. This is going to be the thumbnail. So anywho, let's go right ahead and continue on with uh, battling everybody right here. Let's see. 
I'm not going to be skating, but I am going to be running. And, well, let's go right ahead and see what goes on right here. So, here we are taking on Roller Skater Rollin'. Try saying that 15 times in a row. Roller Skater, Roller Skater Rollin'. And, well, here we are taking on Rollin' and his Pidgey. This right here is easy. Let's go with a Thundershock. And, well, just like that... That was, well, that, that was kind of easy right there. Just a little bit. Okay, so the accuracy has fallen. So let's go one more time, Thundershock, and hopefully this will win it. And yes, Pidgey has been defeated. Yeah, buddy. And, well, Hurricane not doing anything else. Learning some moves, in, or pretty much gaining some levels right there. But that is another victory for us right here. Let's go straight for another person. Let's see what we got. There's going to be another person. Where the hell are you? Huh. I thought there was another person here. Okay, what if we go the other way around? Oh, there you are. Okay, I was about to say, was I smoking weed or something? Huh. Okay, so let's go right ahead and take on another roller skater or another rollerblader. And, well, here we are taking on a, uh, what was it called again? A fletchling. Now... Funny thing is, Fletchling was my initial choice for a Fire-type Pokemon. Unfortunately, in the last recordings, yeah, that wasn't going to be the case because I switched it up for Lit Leo in favor for something else. And it, it just it, it ruined it. It literally ruined it. So that's the reason why we got ourselves Star Fox on our team right here. And, well, there you go. Another victory for us. Bam! Fletchling defeated. And... Aaliyah grows to level 12. This, this right here is a victory for her. And Hurricane, without doing anything else, yes, it's doing something. So, bam. Okay. So, let's see. Let's go ahead and switch out our Pokemon right here. Let's switch it out to Fo Star Fox. We need a... Yeah, we, 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 we really need a Star Fox to start, you know, being a Star Fox. Now, I believe there's a hidden item right here somewhere. Not right there. Right there. We found ourselves some honey. And believe it or not, I think there's like three cases of honey right here somewhere. I don't even know. Um, What if you go right here? Here. Yeah, I'm going everywhere just to see if we can actually find some items right here. But it looks like we're not. So let's go right ahead. Let's get it. And, well, we're going to be taking on Agnes. And, well, here comes Burmy. This Pokemon, this Pokemon right here looks uh, pretty crazy. So let's go straight for an Ember attack. And, well, would you look at that? Would you look at that? A, uh, a Protect attack right there. So let's go right ahead and do it one more time. Ember attack. And just like that, Burmy has been defeated. And that gives us just a little bit more points right there. So here comes another Burmy. So let's go ahead and... And continue on with our same old Pokemon, Star Fox. Looking like a witch right here. So, let's go. Flame flame Charge. And look at that. Turning Super Saiyan. Ready to kick some butt, take some names. Yes. Alrighty. Okay. And, well, the Burmy Trainer. Yes, coming out with another Burmy. So, let's go right ahead and uh, do it again. She's got different kinds of Burmy right there. Okay. I think that's what I'm trying to do, too, in Pokemon X. Collect as many Burmy or different kinds of forms and whatnot. And, well, there you go. Another victory for us. Hurricane mooching off levels. Learning Gust. And, well, Agnes has been defeated. Yeah, buddy. Okay. So, let's see. Who is next in the on the list of Draven right here? Ah, you. And she's like, hey, hey, listen, I'm going to win this battle. Are you? Are you really going to win? Okay, so here we are taking on Preschooler Mia, and she is going to have herself her Badoo. Again, Badoo is differently. Badoo is definitely a Pokemon I want to look at. And let's go straight for an Ember attack right here. Look at that, coming out with his wand. That is pretty awesome right there. Say goodbye to Badoo. All righty. Okay. Alrighty, and uh, well, let's see what else. What else do we need to do right here? Let's see. Oh yeah, there is a, an item right here. 
grab this and we found ourselves a poison barb which will increase the 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 well it will increase the attack or the the stats of a poison type pokemon right here and well let's see not there there might be something right here there might be a hidden item here somewhere or we can talk to this person and well here we go taking on another preschooler and this guy is going to be coming out with an with a magic card this this is going to be funny okay so let's go magic card how's it going unfortunately we're going to have to go with the flame charge and uh i don't know if this is going to make it faint but yeah there we go it's half the hp and well there we go another splash attack so let's go straight for a flame charge attack and just like that, Magikarp, bam, has been defeated. And, well, that's not a lot of points right there. Adrian still has been defeated. So, look at that. Looky, looky. Okay. So, let's go right ahead and continue our little excavation right here. Now, there are two individuals waiting for us. We already know who those guys are. We're going to wait on that. And, I again, I'm still thinking that there's, like, hidden items right here somewhere. So, let's see. Go right here, and yes, we're going to be battling this guy, so let's go ahead and switch up our Pokemon right here. And, okay, that didn't work out, so let's go straight to Aaliyah, and what needs to be done right here is, let's go with a potion, and just like that, bam. Okay, let's go ahead and battle this guy. Padre Way is famous for its hedge grow gardens. If you can defeat me, I'll tell you their official name. I mean, I should have known this for quite some time, but yeah, I probably didn't figure it out. I never ask. I never, you know what? I never really ask. So here we go. Let's get it. Aaliyah versus Courtfish right here, and going in with a Thunder Shock. And. Will would you look at that Corefish almost defeated here comes the bubble attack and wow oh my god all right so here we go thundershock yet again and there you go Corefish defeated okay all righty so hurricane again mooching off our levels right here going up to level 10 while Star Fox grows to level 17 and well there you go all righty so Let's go ahead and grab the... You know what? Let's go ahead and ask this person right here. The official name is the Geometric Gardens. Okay, so that... That really wasn't anything at all. <laughs> okay, so... Let's get the heck out of here. And... Uh, well, let's see. There's... Yeah, there's another individual into... The, well, there's two more individuals right here. So let's go ahead and beat them both. And get on with our lives right here. Okay, let's see. Let's go right here. There you go. And we're going to be going on. Alrighty. So here we have Gardener Fabian wanting to battle us. And he is also going to be coming out with a core fish. So I kind of get why he has one. You know, water type Pokemon, flower, the stuff. And, well, let's go straight for a Thundershock. And, well, that, that right there works. Okay, alrighty. So here comes the bubbly attack, and uh, well, that that right there is not so great. Let's go straight for another thunder shock, and there you go, Corfish defeated. Okay, and well, would you look at that? Leah grows to level 13 and is learning Thunder Wave. That right there is fantastic. Let's uh, you know, let's go ahead and take away Growl, just for right now. Okay. Take away Growl, that's awesome, and, well, more experience points, and the Gardener is not so happy right here. Okay, so, let's see. Is there anything else I need to do right here? Yeah, we gotta switch out Aaliyah, go straight for the Star Fox, and uh, let's go ahead and grab whatever item is there, and then talk to those two individuals. And here we found ourselves an Aether, which will be useful later on. As many of you guys already know, I don't really use ethers a lot, except for maybe e extreme battles. And uh, I haven't done that in quite some time right there, so let's see what this guy has to say. 
I can tell by the look on your face that you just love Pokemon. I really do. I really, really, really do love Pokemon. So here we go, taking on Pokefan Gabe, and he is going to be coming out with a Pichu. Alrighty, Starbox, how's it going? All right, time uh, to ruffle some feathers right here. Let's go, Amber Attack for the win. And well, would you look at that? More points. Here comes a Pikachu. This one's gonna be a little tougher just because it's a little bigger, bulkier. But if we stay away from being physical with this Pokemon, then yes, look at that. That is the result. So there you go, another victory for us. And Hurricane grows to level 11. And just like that, we win again. Yeah, buddy. All right. So let's go. Let's go right here. Actually, there is one thing that I want to do, guys, before we go in and talk to these people. Let's go ahead and do that. I'll be right back with you guys. Okay, so here it is, guys. The Pokemon I want to capture next is Flabebe. And, uh, well, I don't want to really use it for the whole entire walkthrough. It is a very good, it's a serviceable Pokemon, and I, I want to see what I can do with it, especially since... It is a fairy type Pokemon, so let's go ahead and uh, let's see. Let's go ahead and use a great ball right here. All right, great ball. Go. For show. There's one, there's two, there's three, and there you go. All righty. So, there you go, guys. We caught ourselves a new Pokemon, Flabebe. And, well, let's go ahead and add it to the Pokedex right here. Flabebe is the, I would have to say, the introduction to a regular fairy-type Pokemon. As you guys can see, it is a single bloom Pokemon. When it finds a flower it likes, it dwells on that flower its whole life long. It floats in the wind's embrace with an untroubled heart. That is awesome right there. So, let's go ahead and give it the nickname. I bequeath to you the name. Let's see. Oh, it has the, the, two, the, the, the two E's like that. I bequeath to you the name Bebe. That's right, guys. Very generic nickname, but yeah, I think it fits it well. Okay, alrighty. So that wasn't that hard. And, uh, well, let's go ahead and take a look at our newest Pokemon, Flabebe. Bebe. So, Bebe right here is a pure, fi uh, pure fairy type Pokemon. Unfortunately, because of its uh, sassy nature, its speed is going to be down, so that right there is already not, yeah, it's not already not in my favor. But as you guys can see, it does have Tackle, Vine Whip, and Fairy Wind. Eventually, when it fully evolves, it becomes a Grass-type Pokemon. So that is also a, uh, that is also a, a very, po uh, well, that is a positive for us right there. So let's go right ahead and talk to these two people. And as you guys can see, hello there. Have you ever heard a Pokemon called Flabebe? Yeah, I just captured one. Wow, you have one with you! Flabebe is now, brace yourself, a fairy-type Pokemon. Fairy types are... what the fuck? This turned into an entire type matchup system on its head. What? And we've been battling fairy-type Pokemon against other types on Pokemon uh, at Pokemon, uh, or at Pokemon, or types of Pokemon at Professor Sycamore's request. My name is Sinia. It's a beautiful name for a beautiful lady. And I'm Dexio. Two years ago, Professor Sycamore entrusted me with a Pokedex. You can call me a Pokemon Voyage Veteran. If you'd like, I'd, uh, I'll show you the way to the lab. So you come along now. Sure, let's go right ahead and uh, go to the lab right here. And, well, what we're going to find are, are a few things, guys. For instance, if we go right here, they will, they will show us where these Pokemon are, well, where we're going to be going. They're going to be asking us, so how are you and Brexian getting along? The more you uh, walk around with your Pokemon, the stronger your friendship will become. Here, this is the TM for return. This is a move that gets more powerful when your po Pokemon's friendship uh, is strong. So there it is, guys. A very powerful move, which I could probably use for a very physical Pokemon right here. Right through this gate and you'll be in a Lumio City. Go on already. Okay, so let's go ahead and... Uh Get to Lumioi City right here, guys. The big city. And, uh, well, we take a few steps forward right here. Actually, we're trying to take a few steps forward. 
Guess who will find us? Dexio and uh, Senior right here. And they're going to be like, I'll go ahead and wait in front of the lab for you. Follow her to the lab. And, well, she's going to be walking all the way over there. It's too far away. God dang. Well, kind of. Alrighty. So, we're going to be going straight to, not really to the lab, but what we're going to be going to do is going to go straight into the Pokemon Center. But once you get close to the Pokemon Center, here is the lab. And she's going to be like, this building is Sycamore's Pokemon Lab. Let's go inside. So, we're going to be saving that in, we're going to be saving that for next time, guys. Because we got a lot of stuff to do right here. We're going to... Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna stop it right here. So thank you guys again for watching. Um, I know we broke it down into episodes and whatnot. Eh, well, you know the adventure's gonna be continuing and all that crud. I mean we are uploading daily and it's I guess it's fun for you guys and all that stuff. But I just want to say thank you guys again for watching this episode, watching my channel and all that stuff, subscribing. Um, thank you guys again for being patient. I will be back for another episode of our Pokemon Y walkthrough. See you guys.